All right, we're going to talk about ECG calibration. First, we're going to talk about the vertical calibration, which is the amplitude. How high does the waveform go? Each small square is one millimeter squared. Standard calibration, which is what we'll be using, that one millimeter equals 0 0.1 millivolts. So one centimeter, which is 10 millimeters, equals one millivolt. Now, there are other calibrations the, that you just need to know about. One is the half standard calibration. This is used to decrease the amplitude of precordial leads. In this case, one millimeter equals 0 0.2 millivolts. So 0 0.5 centimeters or 5 millimeters equals 1 millivolt. The other one is the 2 times the standard calibration and it, the, this is used to increase the amplitude of the precordial leads. 1 millimeter equals 0 0.05 millivolts. 2 centimeters, which is 20 millimeters, equals 1 millivolt. And this is the uh, two times standard calibration. You see that we have 20 millimeters here, and that equals one millivolt. Okay. Now, this is a um, this is the standard calibration. 10 millimeters equals one millivolt, and in this one it's one to a half okay so this is the standard of 10 millimeters equals one millivolt and this one this is the half of five millimeters equals one millivolt now the next one we're going to talk about is the horizontal calibration. This calibrates for speed. Again, each small square is one millimeter squared. Standard paper speed is 25 millimeters per second, which is the one we're going to use. Each small square equals 0 0.04 seconds or 40 milliseconds. So that means each large square is 0 0.2 seconds or 200 milliseconds. It produces a rectangle that is 10 millimeters high and 5 millimeters wide. Okay, we're going to see a picture of that in a minute. The other speed is 50 millimeters per second. Each small square equals 0 0.02 seconds or 20 milliseconds. So each large square is 0 0.1 seconds or 100 milliseconds. Now this produces a square that is 10 millimeters high and 10 millimeters wide. Now remember, if you put your paper on 50 millimeters per second, the heart rate is half of what it should be and all ECG intervals are twice as long as normal. This one is 25 millimeters per second, and you see it's 10 millimeters by 5 millimeters. The 50 millimeters per second, this is the square, and it's 10 millimeters by 10 millimeters. Okay. 